the fuck does cheeky breaky even mean? So I bet you it's probably some rowdy shit. No, I mean like, what does it mean though? <laughs> what does it mean though? You know what I mean? What, is it, what the fuck does it mean though? Nobody ever told me what the fuck cheeky breaky even meant. That's what I'm, that's what I would like to figure out. Why, what the fuck does cheeky breaky mean? What was that? That's just how close by to a motherfucker, yo. Now I'm gonna go talk to the Soviets, see what the fuck they got in the store. Now I should be fine. Time to go talk over with their, uh, they're uh, Don actually, or their boss or whatever. Let's see what they got going on. Soviets, yo. Soviet faction. Yeah. Bullshit. 
Nigga be bullshit. Hold up, I got my gun away. I got my gun away. I ain't gonna cause any trouble. Hold up, wait, where's your commanding officer at? For your squad. Hold up. Over there. Let's go talk to him for a second. Do that. Side view. Yeah. Something looks weird on my screen. Oh shit! Holy shit! <laughs> damn, that shit wild, yo. Damn. War RP. Speed. Okay, I gotta keep leave that in the RP. Oh shoot. Okay, hold on, let me unequip this. <laughs> Dude, that nigga is busted. He Yeah, I see that shit. <laughs> this nigga is bugging him. Yo, this nigga is wildin' out, yo. <laughs> Holy shit! I saw that shit, that nigga flew to another motherfucker, yo. Real shit. <sighs> Damn. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> What the fuck is that? Thrusters? I think he's using thrusters on his shit. <laughs> Holy crap! That nigga was wildin'. Holy shit, dude, dude, that is some crazy shit. Niggas are flopping. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Holy crap. Those dudes are wild.
Okay, it looks like I guess got into contact with a Weber member. Um, actually, I'm gonna go see what this dude says. Hold up, give me a moment. Juden Goldenstein.
ていうIncredible lack, yeah. I'm here. Hey, can you explain this? I, I came back with six thousand red marks. Really? I have six thousand red marks. <laughs> and you got a PPSH shaking out of you. Oh well, hold up. My bad. Need to put that away. We're the only two people out here on the street right now. I had to make sure that I wasn't walking out there uh, without some protection because I need to make sure that I keep my um, my game tight, man. Some real shit. Really? Hold up, wait, do you need to change your name in order for you to get into your comp or your, your family, my bad? No, no. Actually, well, my family is different. You actually have to change your name in order for you to make it, or make it into the family. To be an official member. So, like, those different families have different types of rule sets, though, but mainly we don't got that many restrictions. It's only for you to change your name, but also... You gotta make sure that you're pretty well trained as well. You can't just have anybody just join in normally. Obviously, we wouldn't have just anybody have their. And not only that, we basically have some pretty well, um, I'd say, pretty well descripted uh, characters as well as my character. My character is pretty well descripted because I've been on here for quite a bit. So I basically have the just of role playing. So I basically earned my rank as Don. So I haven't been. I haven't been new to this. Hold up. Wait, give me one moment. Where are you guys basing at? Like, well, actually, uh, are you sure about that? Oh, yeah, actually, yeah, I think I did. I think I did, actually. But you gotta remember that I didn't own all the doors. So there's a lot of other doors I got. Ooh, shoot. <laughs> Nigga. Alright, now, here's the thing. Close the door. Alright. The Wibbler, Weber, Weber family tree, you know, family, we're all about this one thing. We are technically Soviet spies. Hold up, wait. Wait, you're spying uh, with the Soviets or against them? Okay, I was about to say, with them. That's what I meant. With them. Now, we, we, we spy through the Soviets, we have multiple radios. You know that, uh, that, uh, that German officer who has that all radios radio? Hold up. Actually, I'm not really entirely sure about them. Well, there's one of the German officers that, he's kind of the political guy, and he has a radio that can talk to every single faction. We kidnapped him and took the radio, so we have that. Wait, which one? His name is Eric, whatever. Uh, wait, well, hold up. He's the under officer, actually. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. He, he runs the NCO program and he was the political guy for a while. Well. <laughs> we have his radio as well as a uh, singular Russian and singular German radio. Actually, I actually 
was uh, working with the Soviets not too long ago. I had to go invade over in a German base. I at least killed like three to three Germans over there. I was with the, and not only that, I, w I wasn't over there by myself. I had another Soviet with me, but it was just like me and one other guy, and we were assaulting a compound. Actually, well, um, our family, well, it really isn't that uh, that big at the moment, but it, it can grow up to size, though. We got to make sure that our guys aren't, um, they actually have some pretty decent, um, I'd say, weaponry experience, but not only weaponry experience, you got to make sure you got your shit tight on your description as well. Like, you got to make sure you're around for a while and put in your rank as well as your fucking name, which is uh, not not a lot of people you're gonna see on here, especially doing something like I'm doing. So, and I, not only that, I got my name abbreviated, so because you, you don't often see that shit, yo. Know? My name, but but normally you wouldn't call you wouldn't call my name Jason. So my my name is abbreviated. Let, that's that's my uh, out of character name. That's my. That's why I got it abbreviated like that. It's a matter. Of, well, I was I was starting to think of that. Any anywhere, if we're inside a building right now, nobody that's around here can hear us, except for anybody that's in the area. Mob radios, I think so. Well, basically, the PM would be considered the mob radio. Yeah, so. Or actually, well, um, either that or the OOC. I could just type in mob radio or MR. For mob radio, uh, I'll test that. Test. Juden. Golden Steam. What? Real nigga shit, real nigga shit, real nigga shit. It's working? Okay, nice. Okay, hold up. Should be fine right now at the moment. Doesn't look like we really got much going on actually that we really need to keep an eye out for. I bet you later on that's gonna change. Like mo mostly, um, wait, hold up. You still got six thousand? No. All right, listen. I left with like uh, one hundred ten because I need to pay back from all boss because he bought me my SDG. And I come back and I have six thousand. Now I'm not complaining because I'm confused. I don't really think so. You gave the boss what he asked for and pretty sure he would give you something in return.
Nope, I don't I don't see nothing. Yeah, for me that's different. Hold up. Wait, can you see my SVT? Yeah, I can see it and then put it away like put it your hands. Oh wait, hold up, wait, not that was unequip it. Hold up, my bad. Um boom. See if you go up there first and it sticks right to your body. Like this. Yep, it does. Same thing with the PPSH. Nigga! <laughs> Fuck out of here. I got something planned out. Don't worry about that. I ain't gonna say I think. I got something planned out. Right now, this is my current warehouse right now at the moment. I got a bunch of different areas branched out around the city. Give me one moment. I'm pretty sure I got a tower over in one of these uh, windows. I'm pretty sure. Like, yep, right here. Climb up. You get a watch out over on these streets. Hold up. Give me one moment. Test this for a moment. Oh, shit. Okay, hold up. I got a little bit of lag. Hold up. Yeah, it works. It works, you can shoot through it. I'm just testing these right now because I need to make sure I'm keeping my game tight right now. If something happens, be able to defend. Oh, that's where the other civilian is. No, the civilian's on this right hand side window. Or citizen, or whatever, it's basically the same thing. And hold up. Actually, I think I got a hub, too. Actually. Um, where is it at? Where the fuck is it at? Uh, somewhere. This area I don't got yet, though. This area here, I don't know. So actually, I was thinking about getting this one though. Or actually, well, you said you were actually you were getting it for your family. Cause actually, might, might as well. Cause I, I don't want to be the person owning all the territory. I'm I'm not greedy. Yeah, I bet you they're gonna be around here pretty sure. I I got the 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 stuff to handle it though. If that if it comes down to it, so not completely defenseless. And I have the experience to use bandages and stuff like that. This is the Soviet area. Um, Corleone warehouse again. Um, keep looking for it. I'm pretty sure it's over here. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, hold up, it's over here, actually. Yep. That's on this left-hand side. I got, or actually, well, this is another area, that actually, that I own. And then, this is the, the hub, actually. This is where, basically, where we get the guns in from. 
But here's the thing though, like basically that any anybody that's on here would already know that to be honest if you looked in through that. Cause that's that because that's obviously what hub means. It means the center of attention. Uh gotta make sure you know know what words mean. Um, only person. And this is basically, hold up. Let's see what this is. Let's see what this leads to. Because um, I haven't really had time to check out the serum. Just making sure I get these all set up. Actually. Looks like this is a medic bay. Mortar area. Right up there is the German uh, bunkers actually over on that hilltop. You can get a clear view up here. Or from, from this viewpoint. Hold up, and this is your compound. So those are those quite a diff, uh, quite a bit of areas actually. So hold up. Actually, give me one moment. Hey, yo, we should probably put our weapons away because I'm pretty sure these dudes are gonna be coming back any moment, man. Because I don't want to be standing out here because this is a lot of firepower. I mean, real, real, real talk shit. I recommend we uh, go back over to our compounds. If anything else happens, we can talk it over on the, the mob radio. Just um, make sure that you guys, or keep your guys um, set and uh, don't, um, don't fire in upon our guys.